another topic we want to talk about is the Australian batsmen against spin. We've talked about them up front. We know what Bangladesh. We'll talk later about Bangladesh playing 145 up here. But there's going to be a bit of spin on their diet, on their plates today. Well, that has been their plans uh, through and through. Even uh, the seamers, uh, you'll see a lot of those slower ones into the wicket, uh, which which will be certainly part of the ma major part of the plan uh, for uh, for sure. I won't be surprised if uh, if uh, Shakib is uh, is starting with a new ball as well. You know, so so they will they will like to uh, like to bring that uh, that slow. Uh, slow pace as uh, as early as possible in the game uh, so so that will be certainly one of the tactics even though two seamers start i think you'll see spin playing a part uh, pretty early in the uh, in the innings what have australia done so far in this uh, tournament and i think that will give um, a bit of perspective 389 balls faced seven wickets lost to spin at 6.69 of a run rate an average of 62 so I think these are numbers that Bangladesh will look at if they want to try and assess how they've gone against spin so far. Yeah, I mean exactly. Australia is now see come with the come the IPL and come those kind of services. The Australian batsmen now the amount of spin that they play they probably would not have played before the IPL started. People like David Warner, Steve Smith, they play a lot of spin now, and therefore it's an interesting thing that the Indian Indian batsmen are far more used to pace than they ever used to be used to, and I think Australian batsmen because of the IPL are far more used to spin. They like spin. People like Maxwell thrive on spin. They can hit, you know, they can really hit spin. So I think they'll take on the challenge, and I think it works in Bangladesh's favour also because they want you. They want, come on, take me on because they don't want you to play safe because that's the only way they have a chance of getting wickets. So it's going to be a fascinating contest, I think. Yeah, particularly, I mean, even someone like Khwaja, we don't often talk about him. When you have an explosive lineup like Finch and Warner and uh, Maxwell following later, somehow Khwaja, that's the old one, we're not saying the phrase, <laughs> but he's one of those quiet players who don't get considered, but he'll have a role to play as well. Look, those those numbers are not bad, and, and, and those numbers are not not bad because uh, usually spinners uh, bowl in that uh, second power play, and in second power play, if you are uh, batting at that uh, six, seven, yeah. that six seven uh, runs per over, then you know you are setting a very good platform to finish strong. So uh, so that way, those numbers are not uh, not threatening for Australia. In fact, if not, they will be happy with those kind of numbers. Uh, with Australian uh, Australian batting, you uh, one thing for sure, you know, knowing Trent Bridge track how how it has been and uh, hearing that there is a tinge of grass on the wicket, they may not the ball may not stop. So when the ball starts stopping, Australian batsmen can be in trouble with uh, with with the spin around. But when the ball is coming on to uh, onto the bat, uh, spinners bowling, they would uh, they would f pretty much feel at home because that's the conditions they have uh, back home with a good bounce. And uh, and uh, and then you can trust the bounce and play. You know you can get those singles at uh, at at long on long off, just pushing the ball. Once the ball starts stopping, those kind of shots become difficult. So you can't just play through the line, and that's something which has not worked in Australia's favour. So I think today it's is going to be an easy day with regard to that because uh, because the wicket will well, will be playing well. Uh, in, in in fact, the short boundaries are something which. Uh, which will always play on spinners' mind. So, uh, with that kind of situations and scenarios, I think spinners today will uh, feel the heat with with the ball in hand because you know psychologically also you are thinking, okay, that uh, that side boundary is is shorter, so I can't bowl on the legs. I have to go wider. You know, all you have to have whole lot of things planned. Uh, so, all in all, it might be a tough day for spinners. Uh, but we'll have to wait and see how it goes. But the slow options is always going to be better options uh, against uh, against Australia with this bowling lineup.